Um, I am LaShonda Hart. I am the oldest um, grandchild, and my son Shaquille Hart is the oldest great-grandchild. Um, our granddad was affectionately known as Papa. On behalf of Papa's grandchildren, and as the oldest grandchild, as I've just stated, I will provide a co collective words of love from the grandkids. We lost the real one. Words can't begin to describe the GOAT. He was. He was the greatest of all time to us. It was impossible to leave his calm and enlightening presence without some type of inspiration or a reminder that Jesus is present in our lives when talking to Papa. Papa loved his family and always had been support throughout the years and generations. If it were not for Papa and his ways, we would not be where we are today. He taught us to depend on God, pray, and leave it in God's hands. Everything about Papa was solid. He would come to us about our problems before we could tell him anything and always had an encouraging and active word. And that active word would be for me, I'm dealing with the situation and what he actively said at that time was relevant to what I was going through when he didn't even know it. I know it was nobody but God using my grandfather. That's the active word. Papa was not just the man, Papa was not just the man of words, but everything he said was impactful. We were always on his mind and it showed. Each of us had one-on-one -on -one times, and that made us feel so important. And that's because we were important to Papa. We will miss the phone calls. Everything he would say would be relevant and it would come to pass. It's been such a great honor to have him in our lives at such a time as this. He will never fade in our memory because his name speaks volumes. Ultimately, the impact and legacy of Paul Paul's life will carry us through with the help of God. Thank you all for being here. We love you all. We love the support that you have provided, the phone calls, the text messages, and the love. Thank you so much.